I introduced this episode with the heading, The Diminutive in Brutalism Architecture. As I sat down to write this episode, I had no evidence that this little display was actually constructed as part of the south block of Place Bonaventure. It really does seem diminutive next to the overall size of this complex, cast out of raw concrete. These three unfinished rectangular sentinels do include four of the five features of brutalist rough, unfinished surfaces, unusual shapes, heavy-looking materials, and straight lines. The fifth of the features is having small windows, though the closest we have to transparency of glass are the thin sheets of water streaming down the stainless steel faces of the fourth object set apart from its guardians. Unlike some of the more modern fountains that require pumps, the simplest water designs may not require any at all. There is no requirement of raising a head of water through spigot. There just has to be a steady flow of water. My reasoning is that water pressure in Montreal is between 50 and 60 pounds per square inch. The bottom two lines of this table suggest that this fountain and some others we may have visited are quite simple, as only about 6 to 7 psi would be required here. Understanding how long this structure has been here was a bit of a stretch. Architectural drawings I received through the Fair Dealings provisions of the Copyright Act from the Canadian Centre for Architecture provide me enough evidence to suggest that this little piece appeared as an afterthought. The drawings indicate elevations of 50 to 55 feet, that's about 17 meters. The drawings also indicate the structure and pump facilities below the fountains are at the north end of the site. This site is located at street level and at the south end. The lighting is simple, though it may warrant a nighttime visit next spring just to check it out.